<laughs> hey, who cut the cheese? <laughs> you say that one more time, and I swear I'm gonna hurt you! You know what they say, two's company, cheese a crowd. <laughs> <laughs> Shut it! Hey, hey, what do you call cheese that isn't yours? Look, I'm not playing your game, okay? Nacho cheese! <laughs> Who told you puns are funny? Because they're not! Oh, ow, my head hurts. Good! Yeah, I just don't feel very Gouda. <laughs> Get it? Gouda? I hate you, and I hate your stupid puns. How about a little bit more cheese with your wine? <laughs> That's it. I'm not listening to any more puns. He, he cheese. No. He, no. He cheese. Not cheese. listening. Hey. La, 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 oh, it's time to sing? Okay. La, 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 Ah, uh, that was fun. Let's do it again. No, let's not do it again. Ever. Cheese, don't get angry. You're turning into a monster. <laughs> ah, I can't take it. Someone end this right now. I can't take any more stupid puns. Yes, I am so out of here. Uh-oh. Where are you going, Cheese? Yes. Ah, ow. Oh. Ah, thank you. End my misery. No more puns. No more. Ah. Well, that looks really degrading. <laughs> I regret nothing! <laughs> nothing! <laughs> hey, cheese! Hey, cheese! Are you feeling any chatter? <laughs> no! You really get around. <laughs> How do you do, fruit lovers? Orange and Bear here to answer the questions you've been harboring in the deepest, darkest recesses of your soul! <laughs> or just questions about pizza. Today we're gonna show you how to make a pizza. Yeah, that works too. Woohoo! Come on, Bear! Let's make a pizza with some pizzazz! <laughs> Sounds good to me, Orange. Step one, shape the crust by tossing it in the air. Pro tip! The higher you throw it, the better your pizza will be! Really? Why's that? You know how unbelievably fantastic dreams are called pie in the sky? Yeah. Well, that's because the higher in the sky, the more unbelievably fantastic your pie will be! Duh! That's just science, Bear! Y yeah, I'm not really sure about that, but... Ow! And also, the higher you throw your pizza, the more likely it's gonna hit a bird! And that's free toppings, y'all! <laughs> uh, okay, really, dude? You wanted a pigeon on your pizza? Ah, oh, man! Pigeon? I ordered woodpecker! Yeah! Oh. There we go! <laughs> uh, well, that's a nice segue to step two. Put on your toppings. Uh, apparently, Orange has gone with Woodpecker because, I don't know, he thinks it sounds funny? I don't think it sounds funny, Bear. I know it's funny. How much wood could a Woodpecker peck if a Woodpecker could peck wood? <laughs> wow. Just when I think you can't possibly get more annoying. <laughs> I'm not annoying. I'm an Orange. <laughs> uh, let's just get this over with. Step three. Put it in the oven. <laughs> no! I will not put my pet Woodpecker in an oven. Dude, it's not your pet. It is, too. I already gave him a name and everything. Yeah? What's his name? Woodpecker. You named your Woodpecker Woodpecker? How original. <laughs> I'm not original. I'm an orange. <laughs> okay, okay, fine. We don't have to do step three. We're not going to woodfire your pet bird. <laughs> you mean it? I do. Go on, Woodpecker. Be free. Yay, there he goes. I have to his head repeatedly into whatever. Wait a minute. What type of oven did you say that was again? Oh, it's a wood-fired oven. That's what pizzas get baked in a lot of the time. <laughs> I'm sorry, a wood-fired oven? Uh-oh. Woodpecker, no! Ah! Hey, everyone. Pear and Orange here. Today, we're doing the pizza challenge. You like pizza, right, Orange? Of course. If you ask me, anyone who doesn't like pizzas is a real weirdo. <laughs> Here's how it'll work. We've got 10 mystery ingredients hidden inside these bags. Orange and I will each pick five. Whatever's inside our bags, we have to put it on our pizza. Then we gotta eat a slice, whether it's nasty or nice. <laughs> you wanna go first or should I? Me, I wanna go. Let me at these toppings. Okay, go ahead. Gimme, 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 gimme. Topping, 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 topping. I said you could go first. Yeesh, sorry, I didn't hear you. No ears. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go with bag number 10. Okay, what's inside? Extra cheese. Extra cheese? That's barely even a topping. Ooh, is somebody jealous? I'm not jealous. Yeah, uh -huh. look at yourself. You're green with envy. <laughs> I'm always green, dude. That's just what color I am. 
Okay, I'm gonna go with number five. Looks like I picked black beans. Is that even a pizza topping? Anything's a pizza topping, Pear, as long as it's on a pizza. Wow, thanks, dude. That was really deep. More like deep dish, am I right? <laughs> nah. Well, I guess I'm putting black beans on my pizza, even though they do give me really bad gas. Ah, quit your whining. Don't be such a party poo pair. <laughs> okay, mystery bag number three has pepperoni. Woohoo! So far, this challenge is a pizza cake. <laughs> I'll say, I just got pinto beans. These make me even gassier than black beans. What'd you get? Ooh, it's a good one. In all my life, I've never sausage a delicious pizza. <laughs> sausage? Why are you getting all the normal pizza toppings? Well, meanwhile, I'm getting lima beans. Oh, don't be mad, Pear. It's just a fun little challenge video. Try to have a good time. A rootin' tootin' good time. <laughs> no. Oh, man. I got one I'm not too excited about. It's about time. What'd you get? Anchovies? No. I got Parmesan cheese. Can you believe it? Wait, you got more cheese? Dude, that sounds delicious. Eh, I'll admit it's good, but not great. <laughs> Get it? Parmesan, great. Ugh, I got it. And I also got kidney beans. And I got bacon. Woohoo! Bacon? How is this fair? You have like every delicious pizza topping, and meanwhile, my pizza over here is looking like a bean museum. Relax, Pear. You still have one mystery ingredient left. Maybe it'll pull the whole pizza together. <sighs> I doubt it, but let's check it out. What is this? Tootie Toot 2000X? Oh, maybe it's medicine that makes you stop farting. See, I told you it would all work out. No, no, it's actually the exact opposite. It makes you fart, like 2,000 times more than usual. <laughs> oh man, who packed these mystery bags? An American hero, that's who. Oh, can we please just put these toppings on and get the pizzas in the oven? I wanna be done with this. Nah, don't worry, Pear. This too will pass. <laughs> oh. All right, our pizzas are baked and ready to eat. Unfortunately for me, it's now time to eat an entire slice. Just one slice? I ate the whole thing. So yummy. You don't have to rub it in, dude. We know you got the better pizza. Your turn, Pear. Your turn to eat your pizza. I'm aware. Go ahead. Anytime. I will, okay? Now's a good time. Everyone's waiting. Okay. Wait. This tastes different than I thought it would. What do you mean? I taste pepperoni and sausage, orange. Did you eat the wrong pizza? <laughs> of course not. How the heck would I mix up the... Ow. Oh. oh, that's different. Orange? Pear, I need you to listen very carefully. I want you to get everyone and take them out of the kitchen. But, Orange... Listen to me. Get everyone outside, start running, and keep running. Get as far away from this kitchen as you possibly can. We don't have much time. Orange, you're kind of looking... Pear, this is not a drill. You need to listen to me and... Go. Oh, it's too late. What? What do you mean? <laughs> You've heard the term pie in the sky before, right? Sure. Well, you're about to see it and smell it too. Orange, I'm getting kind of scared. <laughs> ah! Hey, fruit lovers, welcome to How Do Do, How Do You Do Do. <laughs> uh, hey, folks, I'm Pear, and this is my co host, Orange. And uh, uh, you're my co host. It doesn't matter, dude. The channel's not called the Boring Pear, it's called the Amazing Orange. I hate to break it to you, dude, but it's not called the Amazing Orange. Yo, what you talking about? What else would it be called? It's called the, okay, listen, can we just put a pin in this? Sure thing, co-host. Let's check out today's prompt, which I also put a pin in. <laughs> har har, very funny. This week, James Meza wants to know how to make a pizza. Woohoo! this is great. I love pizza. Oh, you do? Huh? Orange, I had no idea. I always heard you had a thing for passion, so I always assumed you didn't have a thing for me. Um, I, I was just saying that I'd love to... Pizza, yes, I heard you. And now that you're so bravely put your feelings out in the open, I can finally be open about mine. I love you too, Orange. I've always loved you. Um, uh, a little help here, Pear! No way, dude. You know how long I've been waiting to do a how-to episode with you preoccupied? Yeah! Later, dude. Have fun. Ha! All right, step one for making a pizza.
toss the dough, then put on toppings. My personal favorite is pineapple. Did I hear you correctly, Pear? Uh... I like you too. Oh, I've been waiting so long to hear you say those words. Oh, ah, oh, 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 a little help here, Orange! I'm a big busy bear! Ah! Excuse me, did you say you think ovens are super hot? Because um, I just so happen to think tiny fruits are super hot. <laughs> He's asking for a little help. <laughs> nice, looks like it's grapefruits time to shine. Picking up where they left off, step three is to cut the pizza into slices. <clears throat> I absolutely love slices of pizza. I said I absolutely love slices of pizza! Huh, okay. Well, I also love pretty much every pizza topping out there. I love mushrooms, I love sausage, I love olives, I love pepperoni. I know it's an atypical pizza topping, but I love passion fruit! Really? Nothing? I'm gonna die alone. From these great heights, there is nothing a berry cannot see. Great distances shrink to mere inches. One soon realizes that anyone can conquer space. The impossible challenge, of course, is to conquer time. I'm here, I'm here. Don't look at the clock. All that matters is that I'm here now on top of the fridge with delicious pizza. Whew. All right, delivery for Mr. Grapefruit? Uh, excuse me, have you seen Mr. Grapefruit up here? Why, why I haven't seen anyone up here, not since the Taft administration. Ah, oh, no, I must be in the wrong place. I, I gotta go find him. Uh, don't go, uh, tell me, is the two-step still the bee's knees? Are cat's pajamas still the cat's meow? Uh, I really gotta take this. Happy, where the heck are ya? Hey boss, I'm still trying to find Mr. Grapefruit. It's been nearly 30 minutes. Must I remind you again of our policy? I know. Delivery's in 30 minutes or it's free. But there's no one on top of the fridge. Ah, jeez, on top of the fridge? Pepe, your sausage brain, he just called big. His address is at the bottom of the fridge. But the address on the box... No buts or it'll be your butt! Now get down there now! Oh, man. It looks really windy. If you're looking to hop on the good foot and do the bad thing, yeah, I hear there's a gin mill with top-notch giggle juice. <laughs> yeah, I'm out of here. Come on, Pepe. You can do it. You're almost there. Well, well, well. If it isn't the pizza I ordered 33 minutes ago. My leg, please. I tried my best to get it here. For some reason, your address was written down as being on top of the fridge, and my boss is going to be so mad if I... You know I what this is? Um, what? No. It's me playing the world's tiniest violin. Admittedly, the joke works better if you have hands, but what I'm saying is that this is a you problem, not a me problem. Now leave me and my buddies to my pizza. Good day! Oh man! <laughs> this is a brilliant scheme, Grapefruit. We tell the pizza place a fake address, then pretend like they got it wrong! <laughs> Free pizza for life. This is great! You know what? I could go for some anchovies. How about you, fellas? Definitely! It's on the house. <laughs> Jiminy Christmas, get the phone already, Pepe! Yeah! Hello, this is Pepe. Grapefruit here. I'm gonna need another row, uh, 12 pizzas delivered. 12? Wow! All right, uh, what's your address? What's the address, guys? Something he couldn't possibly deliver to. How about the bottom of the fish tank? On top of the ceiling fan. Ooh, I got it! Deliver it to me, right next to the toaster oven. The kitchen doesn't have a toaster oven. Exactly. See you in less than 30 minutes. <laughs> what a dweeb. Have you seen a toaster oven anywhere? Yeah, I saw one at your mom's house. Rude. Come on, just tell me where the toaster oven is. Up your butt and around the corner. <laughs> Not helpful. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. It's been like 31 minutes. Grapefruit, there you are. Here I am. Now where are my 12 free pizzas? Oh, they were too heavy to carry, so I brought some help. But please, I know it took too long, but I couldn't find the toaster oven anywhere, and... That's because there is no toaster oven, you moron! There isn't? No. 
Seriously, how did you not know that? You tricked me? Yeah, we tricked you. What are you going to do about it, Pipsqueak? Give us our pizzas and go cry to your mommy about it. Or perhaps his godfather? Huh? Meet my boss, Chicago style. It seems you boys like anchovies. Yes, sir. Yes, we do. Let me ask you a question. You boys like swimming too? Uh, yeah, we like that too. I, I guess. Good. So I guess you love sleeping with the anchovies. Huh? For future reference, we do deliver to the bottom of the fish tank. Pepe, what can I say, buddy? I'm sorry I doubted you. Oh, uh, it's okay. Do I get promoted? Sure, no problem. You're the new delivery boy. Slash restroom cleaner. <laughs> awesome! Moving on up! <laughs>